Imagine a therapy that promises better skin, faster recovery, deeper sleep, even improved brain health. All by standing in front of a red light. Too good to be true? That's what many thought. Until NASA, professional athletes, and thousands of clinical studies started pointing in the same direction. But with the hype also comes confusion and a market flooded with devices that range from medical grade to outright gimmicks. In this video, we'll break down the real science of red light therapy, uncover what it can and can't do, and show you the devices actually worth your money. Plus, we will share exclusive discounts so you don't overspend. What is red light therapy? Red light therapy, also known as photobiomodulation or low-level light therapy, uses specific wavelengths, usually 600 to 1,000 nanometers. Unlike UV rays, they don't burn or damage. Instead, they penetrate into the skin and deeper tissues, interacting with your mitochondria, your body's energy power plants. Think of it like giving your cells an extra energy charge. That boost translates into more efficient repair, reduced inflammation, and better performance at the cellular level. But here's what most people don't know. Red light therapy isn't just one thing. There are two main categories. Red light at 660 nanometers, which primarily affects surface tissues like skin, and near infrared at 850 nanometers, which penetrates deeper to muscles, joints, and even organs. The best devices combine both wavelengths for maximum benefit. Scientists first explored red light therapy with plants, then with astronauts. They discovered red and near-infrared light enhanced wound healing in space. Since then, research has grown dramatically. Here's what's been documented in clinical and lab studies. Cellular energy. Red light enhances ATP production, the fuel for every process in your body. Oxidative stress reduction. It helps cells handle stress and repair faster. Circulation boost. It encourages microcirculation meaning tissues get more oxygen and nutrients. Tissue regeneration. Evidence suggests red light stimulates stem cell activity, speeding healing. The mechanism behind this magic lies in cytochrome C oxidase, an enzyme in your mitochondria that literally absorbs red and near-infrared light. When this happens, it triggers a cascade of beneficial cellular responses, increased nitric oxide production for better blood flow, enhanced protein synthesis for tissue repair, and improved cellular communication. Benefits, skin health. Let's start with what the beauty industry loves, skin. Red light therapy boosts collagen and elastin, the building blocks of youthful, firm skin. It reduces wrinkles, minimizes scars, and even helps acne by reducing inflammation. But here's the critical part, the device power and wavelength matter. Many cheap beauty gadgets are underpowered, delivering light that looks nice but doesn't penetrate deep enough. If you're looking for real results, you need clinically effective devices. Clinical studies have shown remarkable results. Participants using medical-grade red light therapy experienced up to 31% improvement in fine lines and wrinkles after just 12 weeks. The key is consistency. Most users start seeing improvements in skin texture and tone within two to four weeks, with dramatic changes becoming visible after two to three months of regular use. Benefits, pain, and recovery. Athletes swear by red light therapy. By reducing inflammation and enhancing circulation, it speeds up muscle recovery, lowers soreness, and even helps with joint pain. Clinical studies have shown improvements for arthritis, tendon injuries, and even nerve pain. That's why you'll find red light panels in pro athlete recovery centers and cutting edge gyms worldwide. But you don't need to be a professional athlete to benefit. Office workers using red light therapy report reduced back and neck pain from sitting all day. Research shows red light therapy can reduce muscle fatigue by up to 50% and decrease recovery time by 24 hours. For anyone dealing with chronic pain or slow recovery, this could be life-changing. Benefits. Mood, brain, and sleep. This therapy doesn't stop at the skin or muscles. It also influences the brain. 
Red light at near-infrared wavelengths can penetrate the skull and may improve cognitive performance, memory, and even symptoms of depression. It also helps regulate melatonin production. Exposing yourself to red light in the evening can lead to deeper, more restful sleep, while daytime use can stabilize circadian rhythms. For those struggling with seasonal affective disorder or insomnia, this is a potential game-changer. Recent studies show participants scored 20% higher on cognitive tests after just four weeks of treatment. For sleep, using red light 30 minutes before bed can increase melatonin production by up to 58%, leading to faster sleep onset and deeper REM sleep. How to use effectively. Before we talk devices, let's cover the basics of effective use. Distance matters. Most panels work best at 6 to 12 inches from your body. Closer isn't always better. You want even light distribution, not hot spots. For skin benefits, 10 to 15 minutes daily is ideal. For muscle recovery, 15 to 20 minutes post-workout works best. For sleep improvement, use it 30 minutes before bed. Consistency beats intensity. Most people see initial results in 2 to 4 weeks, with peak benefits at 8 to 12 weeks of regular use. Devices. What works and what doesn't. Now, let's talk devices. Not all panels and lamps are equal. The key factors are Wavelength. Effective ranges are 630 to 660 nanometers, red, and 810 to 850 nanometers, near infrared. Irradiance. The intensity of light matters. Too weak, and you won't see results. Treatment area. Larger panels are better for systemic effects, while handhelds are good for targeted use. Here are some of the top recommended products. Juve Solo 3.0. Premium medical grade. Best full body panel. Mito Red Light. More affordable, still strong clinical performance. Platinum LED Biomax. High irradiance with multi-wavelength targeting. Huga handheld. Budget-friendly and portable for spot treatments. When evaluating devices, look for third-party testing results. Reputable manufacturers will provide irradiance measurements at different distances. Avoid devices that only show power consumption, that tells you nothing about light output. All these devices are linked with exclusive discounts in the description. If you're serious about results, we recommend starting with one of these instead of wasting money on beauty lamps. So, does red light therapy work? The science says yes, but only when it's done right. With the right wavelengths, power, and consistency, it can improve skin health, accelerate recovery, ease pain, balance mood, and support better sleep. The key is to choose the right device and use it regularly. Remember, red light therapy isn't a magic cure-all, but it's one of the most promising wellness technologies backed by real science. Start with realistic expectations. Be consistent with your routine and give it time to work. Which benefit excites you most? Beauty, recovery, or sleep? Drop your answer in the comments. And don't forget to check the links in the description to grab a device at a discount. Thanks for watching The Ageless Protocol, where we bring you evidence-based wellness and tech insights for a longer, healthier life. Subscribe for more deep dives.